Hello everyone, this is Matthew Morales with Quiet Mind Yoga, and I am here for your 12 p.m. breath work and meditation practice. I am on a few minutes early just so we can have people jumping on and I can get settled in, you all can as well. Hey Rebecca, hope you're doing well this Thursday. It was beautiful out this morning. I went for a walk and a run with my dogs. Ah, oh, it was beautiful. But something that I'm noticing is more and more people are starting to wear, or less and less people are starting to wear um, masks as they are out running on the trails, which was interesting to me. I still have my mask on. Also, if y'all have a uh, specific breath you wanna work on today, let me know. If there's one that's just calling to you, I am more than happy to facilitate that one. Oh, I love this stuff. Hey, Emily. I'm getting myself situated. You all do the same, whatever you may need. Go for a walk, but it won't be as nice. It will be much hotter when you go for your walk if you haven't already. Yes, that's why I went early. Oh, it feels so nice. Again, if y'all have a specific breath that you want to work on, or if there's something specific coming up for you, and maybe you want me to kind of gear this practice towards that, please let me know. I don't see all the comments um, that come up through here that are the ones that are scrolling. But if I see it, then absolutely, I will work towards that. So y'all let me know if there's something that you need because this is for you. I did my practice right before this actually. And oof, I did a, a yoga practice, an asana practice, so I was moving through poses that was focused on balance. Oh my God, y'all, it brought up so much frustration because it was, I'd say probably 60 to 70% of the class was in new poses that were focused on balancing. And balancing is my one thing that I work on probably the least because it's not my strong suit, but I want to strengthen it. That's why I was doing it. Oh my God. When we don't know something or we're not so accustomed to it, the frustration that can come up is, it's intense, but it was wonderful. It was wonderful to get to go through that and release that too. So I don't see anything specific. Hopefully I don't miss something. We're gonna start in about one minute, two minutes possibly. So again, get yourself situated if you need a drink, um, anything, really incense. So yes. Uh, yeah, you're afraid that less and less people will be wearing masks as time goes on. Yeah, I can see that. Um, and same thing here. Um, it brings up fear for me to see that less and less people are caring as much. Um, yeah, I mean, that's how I see it. I'm not saying that people don't care as much, but they're just getting a little bit more relaxed with everything that's going on. And yeah, that's, you know, that we get to work on how we respond to that um, and how we process that. Not necessarily we can't do anything to make them do something um, but we get to work on how we feel about it and that fear that we may feel or the anxiety that we may feel by seeing other people not wearing masks because that's how I saw it as I was running. I was like, I want to tell everyone on the trail, put on a mask, put on a mask. Um, and there's a way to say that, but not necessarily in that situation. Um, so yeah, I get that. We'll see. Let's see how all this goes with everything easing up. See if it's the curve starts to go down or if it rises back up. I have a feeling it's gonna rise back up. But again, that's my opinion. I do not know. We shall see. All right. Um, so I didn't get a specific breath that we are working on today. So the one that I'm gonna choose for us, and we do have a 15 minute meditation today. I felt like it was necessary to meditate for a little bit longer. Um, yeah, just cause I felt we needed it. 
I need it as well. So the breath that we're gonna start off, we're gonna jump right into the breath, is gonna be uh, Bastrika, which is a forceful inhale and the forceful exhale through the nose. So what this breath helps to do is helps to balance the energy that's in your body. Um, it helps to realign the balance, uh, the energy, the chakras, if you're into that, the energy centers that are in our body, helps to bring them all into alignment and balance. Also helps to clear any energy that it, you've been holding onto or that might be stuck. This helps to really move that because it is a forceful breath. So it is meant to move things in our bodies. So the way this breath works, it's a forceful inhale and a forceful exhale all through the nose. So sometimes I like to place a hand on my belly. So as I inhale, my belly expands. And this is just for y'all to watch. You're not, you don't need to jump in just yet and do it with me, but I'm gonna uh, show it to you right now, demonstrate it. So as I inhale, my belly expands. And as I exhale, my belly contracts. Again, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. So you can notice that you're hearing my breath as well. And again, both the inhale and the exhale are forceful. It's gonna look like this um, in a continuous motion like this. Now, if you're not so used to breathing into your belly, you can take it at a slower pace. Maybe you go something like this. Even if you take it slower, you can notice that you're still hearing a forceful inhale and a forceful exhale. That doesn't mean it has to be soft. If you're used to this breath, maybe you take it a little bit faster, something like this. Alrighty, now know that we're gonna be doing this for three minutes. So if it gets to be a little bit too tiresome for your core and it's just too much and the, it's painful at any point, take a break. Take a normal inhale, a normal exhale, and then jump back in to the practice with us. Alrighty, so sit up nice and tall. And it's gonna be you, your choice if you wanna keep your eyes open or if you close your eyes, it's completely up to you Lengthen through the spine, ground down through your sit bones. And you can be in a cross-legged position. You can be sitting on a chair, on your bed, wherever you need to be right now. Reach the crown of your head and your ears up towards the ceiling. And if you're gonna close your eyes, go ahead and close them already. Hands, place them where you'd like, maybe on your knees or one hand on your belly. Again, this is a forceful inhale and a forceful exhale through your nose. We're going for three minutes. Alexa, set timer for three minutes. Three minutes, starting now. Everyone inhale, fill the belly up. Exhale, empty out completely. And begin your forceful inhales and exhales. You're a minute in, you have two minutes left. See if you can pick up the pace a tiny bit more. Keep it going, forceful inhale and exhale. Lengthen through the spine. You're over halfway through, keep it going. If there's discomfort rising in the body, 
Keep pushing through it. I promise it will pass. Keep it up. You're over two minutes, you have 45 seconds left. Pick up the pace even more. You have 20 seconds left. Give it all you've got. Go for it. Everyone, inhale, fill the belly up and hold the breath at the top. Hold it. Soften the jaw, relax your throat, but hold the breath. Exhale through your teeth. Shh. Inhale through your nose, fill the belly up and hold. Hold it. Take in a little more. Exhale, shh. Last one, inhale, deepest breath, fill up. Hold it. Take it a little more up into your chest, up into your shoulders, a little more. Hold. Exhale, shh. Keeping the eyes closed, come back to breathing in and out through your nose, deep into the belly. Notice if you feel any difference. Notice you, if you can feel anything that's here for you that you maybe didn't notice before. Maybe some emotions, maybe some thoughts. And if you don't see any of that, that's perfectly fine. There's no right thing, right or wrong thing to feel or see right now. And then gently blink the eyes open. All right, we have a second round, same thing. It's uh, Bastrika, the forceful inhale and the forceful exhale. So we're gonna jump right in since you've already done it once. Sit up nice and tall, close the eyes. Place your hands wherever you would like. We're doing it another three minutes. Alexa, set timer for three minutes. Three minutes, starting now. Everyone inhale, fill the belly up. Exhale, empty out completely. Begin, forceful inhale and exhale. Make sure both are forceful, the inhale and the exhale, not just one. You're a minute in, you have two minutes left. Keep up the pace. You 
you're over halfway through. See if you can pick up the pace just a tiny bit more now. Again, any discomfort that is rising in the body, keep pushing through it. I promise you, it will pass. You've got this. You're two minutes in, one minute left. Thirty seconds left. Give it all you've got. Go for it. Let the energy move up and out through your body. Keep going. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one, everyone inhale, fill the belly up. Exhale through the mouth, empty out completely. Hold the breath out, hold it out, don't inhale. Navel to spine, hold it out. Inhale through the nose. Open the mouth, exhale it out. Empty out, empty out, hold the breath out. Don't inhale. Inhale. Last one, open the mouth, stick the tongue out, clearing breath. <sighs> hold the breath out, empty out. Navel to spine. Inhale, and bring it back to your normal breath, in and out through your nose. Option to keep the eyes closed if you'd like. From here, we are making our way into our meditation. If you'd like, you can open the eyes for a moment. The meditation that we are gonna do today is so hum meditation. So that's the mantra that you're gonna be using, so hum. Every time you're inhaling internally, you say to yourself the word so, and every time you're exhaling, you say to yourself hum. Again, inhaling so, exhaling hum. This is a very unifying meditation. It is a meditation that means I am that. I am connected to all that is. We are all connected. We're all part of the same ocean. We are not separate from one another. We are all the same. And that's what this meditation helps to solidify. I thought that would be something good to do right now because I see myself seeing people as separate of why are you doing that? Why aren't you taking your precautions? Why aren't you wearing your mask? And it's always a great practice to come back to noticing they are me, we are the same. That helps me have so much more compassion and empathy for everyone around me. So meditation today is so hum. Sit up nice and tall. Again, every time you inhale, you say to yourself, so. And every time you exhale internally, you say to yourself, hum. We're gonna be doing this for 15 minutes. Alexa, set timer for 15 minutes. 15 minutes, starting now. Alexa, play Tibetan singing bowls. Tibetan singing bowls breathe by 33 bowls on Amazon Music. Start to follow your breath if you haven't already. Eyes are closed, lengthen through the spine. Follow every inhale and every exhale. And start to incorporate the mantra, so hum. 
Inhaling so, exhaling hum, keep it going. If you notice that your mind is going to thoughts, drop the thoughts and pick the mantra back up. So hum.
notice if your mind is wanting to drift away into thoughts. If so, that's okay. Let the thoughts go and pick the mantra back up. Inhaling so, exhaling hum.
keep the eyes closed. Go ahead and drop the mantra. Bring a little more of a deeper breath into the body to start to wake yourself back up gently. Maybe rock the head gently from side to side. Maybe even make a couple circles. And as you're ready, gently blink the eyes open. All right. And that is your breath work and meditation practice for today. Thank you all so much for joining and for doing this for yourselves. Um, before we jump off of the call, I do want to ask a question. If any of you would be interested in a Zoom class where we do some yoga and then we have like a Q&A, kind of a, a question and answer, but really room for anyone to share what's coming up for them. Um, more of a sense of that community. I know that that was a beautiful thing that about having the studio space, a brick and mortar, is that you're able to talk to people. And so I wanna see if maybe you'd be interested in doing the Zoom class where we can open it up afterwards for some discussion. Um, and any questions you may have that I could answer, I would be happy to do that. So if you are interested, leave a comment or message me saying just interested, and that's it. Um, so yes, thank you for joining me. Much love. To all of you, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Please join us tonight at 7 p.m. We will be doing Power Vinyasa, getting things moving, that anxiety and the fear that's building up, I know, in me, building up in a lot of others. We're going to get that moving and out of the body. Alrighty. Namaste and much love to all of you all. Take care.